Before we start the service, I'd like to ask you if you have a mobile phone or a smartphone, please switch it off or set it into a silent mode so that no sound will be heard, such as alarm sound or shutter sound. Also, please be careful about your personal belongings. Now, let us start the second worship service of the Lord's Cross Christian Center, Tokyo Antioch Church, on June 25th, 2017. Now, let me pray. Dear Heavenly Father, I praise your name. Thank you for gathering each one of us here to this second worship service so that we'll be able to worship you together. I pray that you will help us to worship you by spirit and truth. Help us to sing praise songs to you by spirit and truth. I also pray that you will pour out your abundant blessings upon each one of us. In the beginning, I pray this prayer in the name of Jesus. Amen. Now, let us sing praises to the Lord in song. Now, if you can, please stand up and sing praises to the Lord together. Machi no zon da toki ga kita Tachi agate susumi Tsuno ふきならしてさあ時の声を上げようもジョイジョイ喜びの声を上げようどんな時でも主が共におられる Joy, joy, sambi no uta o uta o Subarashi koto o nasareta shu ni kamsha shimasu Mojito machi no zonda Machi no zonda toki ga kita Tachi agate susumi Tsuno ue fuki narashite Sa toki no koe wo age yo Joy joy yo no kobi no koe wo age yo どんな時でも主が共におられるジョイジョイ賛美の歌を歌おう素晴らしいことをなされた主に感謝しますジョイジョイ Joy, joy, yorokobi no koe o age yo. Donna toki de mo shuga tomo ni orareru. Joy, joy, sambi no uta o uta o. Subarashi koto o nasareta shu ni. Shimasu, 
The Lord s doing things for you. You've been、uh, caused to live for eternity and you've been given victory. And when you listen to God's voice and obey it, when you keep obeying Him, the Lord encourages you to keep doing it, said the Lord. The Lord loves you deeply and He gives you the best plan for your life. And you receive his words from the Bible and through prophecies and receive his blessings, said the Lord. In various problems and difficulties, give thanks to God and praise him for everything. You might find yourself doing that on the surface of your heart, but then. He You will, but soon you'll be convinced that the Lord is putting your, His hand upon you, and so will solve your problem, and the Lord will build you up and strengthen your faith, said the Lord. Now let's sing one more praise. Let's clap our hands to the Lord to give thanks to Him. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for leading this praise and worship. I pray that you will continually bless this service. 
In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. Now, let us have a time of individual prayers. Let us quiet ourselves before the Lord and have fellowship with Him in prayer individually. Let's finish praying and sing one more praise to God. その通りになるから Now, let us pray the Lord's Prayer together. The Lord's Prayer, Our Father which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Now, uh, Pastor Paul Akimoto will lead the Holy Communion. We now have the Holy Communion. The Holy Communion is to proclaim the death of Jesus. In a church, you're welcome to join the ceremony even if you are not a member of this church. If you believe in the Lord Jesus as your Savior and you have been baptized or you'd like to be baptized in the near future, if you are watching this service on the internet, and if you believe in the Lord Jesus as your Savior, and you have been baptized, or well, you'd like to be baptized in the near future, please prepare bread and wine or grape juice by yourselves and join us. Dear Heavenly Father, I pray for you to bless this bread and wine and grape juice here, and please bless the bread and wine and grape juice that those who are watching this service on the internet have prepared. I pray this prayer in the name of Jesus. Amen. Now let us have a time of prayer 
a, a time of prayer or repentance silently and if you have sins in your hearts please confess them to God. Jesus took bread, gave thanks and broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take it, this is my body. Let's partake in the body of Christ. This is my blood of the covenant, which is poured out for many, he said to them. Let us partake in the blood of Christ. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for this grace of the Holy Communion. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. We now have a time of offerings to give thanks to the Lord. Let us offer unto Him as we sing Shiki first together. Kami 
の国と神の義をまず求めなさい。そうすれば皆は耐えられる。晴れる。晴れる。ファースタは金だもが、and he is like a snake, and all these things shall be a d e a r to you. Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Now, let us let me pray to give thanks to the Lord for these offerings. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for these offerings. We now have offered a part of what you have given us. I pray for you to sanctify them. And use them for the work of your kingdom. I also pray that you will bless each one of those who have offered abundantly. We thanksgiving in the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. Now, let me read a scripture for today's message. Today's message will be from Mark chapter 13, verse 31. Mark chapter 13, verse 31. Now, let me read. Heaven and earth will pass away, but my words will never pass away. Pastor Paul Akimoto will bring us a message from this scripture after special music and congregational praise and worship. Good morning, we are gifts. We are going to sing a homesick, sick, homesickness. Oh, oh, oh. 
他是塞阿尤姆，他比西尔鲁希马德，亚加特姆卡尔鲁，阿沃基米鲁托基，马奇诺索米特苏苏马。奥斯基诺哟纳，光に満ちた、かけがえなきその愛。しも悲しみも、傷も涙も。好きさりて安らぐ。宝石のような光に満ちた、かけがえなきその愛。しも悲しみも。傷も涙も過ぎ去りて安らぐ If you can please stand up. I'm not afraid. 
Don't rush, don't hurry. Just stand on my word and receive my word and stand in my word, said the Lord. My word is your sure deliverance and sure salvation, said the Lord. In Tokyo Antioch Church, you not only have church members who are present here, but also you have online church members. In the whole wide world. And to pastor all those people, the head of the church is Christ. And as, you, as your church is growing, I will manifest my being head pastor vividly among you, said the Lord. My work will advance. So, Stand firm in my reading and do my will, said the Lord, and you be involved in a great harvest, said the Lord. In the 21st century, uh, I will cause you to be able to deal with things that will happen in this time. Both practically and spiritually, I will cause you to pray to the point and I will and and do research to be able to to pray at the po to the point said the Lord seek me and if you are giving up repent and seek me eagerly and then I will give you reading and I will do my work said the Lord on the basis of the church uh, there will be more uh, works in the church. And I will open more doors to do uh, social services in the whole wide world through you, said the Lord, through the work of the church, said the Lord. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for the words of prophecy. Thank you for the special music we are going to learn from your word. I pray that you will speak to us because you are the living God. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. Good morning, everyone. To those who are watching this service on the internet, good morning. Hello. Good evening. We as a church give a tithe offering to other churches and Christian organizations. And we now we'd like to give a tithe offering of 94,300 yen. Now, let me pray. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for meeting the needs of our church, Tokyo Antioch Church. Now we'd like to give a tithe offering of 94,300 yen to other churches and Christian organizations. Please use them. Thank you that you always meet all our needs and fill us financially. Abundantly, and your grace and blessings are overflowing among us. Thank you for that, and we praise you for that. And we thank you for this privilege to give a tithe offering. In the name of Jesus, amen. Now, good morning again, and let us watch a short movie about Nauris to Patmos Island.
From July 11 to 20th, uh, we go on our race to Patmos and we have holy meetings, but we focus on praying there. If you are led by God, please come and join us. What I feel about this outreach is that as I, as I have looked back my Christian life, in the beginning stage of my Christian life, I, I experienced that the Lord answered my prayers and He, he solved my problems and blessed, us, blessed me. But as I grew as a Christian, and, and, and I've become old now, yesterday we had a birthday party yesterday at home uh, because uh, uh, my family thought uh, thought how old I am and but I thought that was not my age I thought I was much younger than that <laughs> anyway as, as I have been growing as a Christian, I have been experienced more and more about uh, uh, how joyful fellowship it is to fellowship with God. And what I have been realizing is that, of course, by prayer, by praying eagerly and hard, uh, we can grow, but also when the Lord uh, leaves us and he, when He pours out His presence upon us, we are able to pray more and have deep fellowship with God. On uh, that outreach to Patmos, we were involved in the coup incident in Istanbul on our way back to Japan from Patmos. Uh, then we thought we might die. And there was a uh, there was uh, a possibility that we might die, but fortunately nobody was killed. But the Lord spoke to us through this and that now the time has was changed. Now we live in an age that n anything can happen. And individually, the Lord asked me, are you prepared? If you are about to die now, well, the, the team members 
looked at me and they saw that I was calm in that situation, but I was not calm in my heart. I was just sitting and and they just looked at me and I looked as if I was calm in, in this situation. You know, but I was spoken to by God that I was questioned by Him. If I am prepared, if I was, would be prepared, if we, I feel I am faith, faced with death, I'm not saying to you that we are going to die very soon, but uh, we will die sooner or later. Uh, we in Japan we now have a problem about the North Korea, and you know this is dangerous situation here in Japan because of the North Korea, and we need to make preparations. And you know, of course, we know that we we'll go to heaven when we die after we die. But when we come to come into a situation where we are close to death. We, are we prepared? And ha we are we prepared? And can we think that we did everything that we should do here on this earth? Uh, when I was sick, and I was hospitalized, and in the hospital, uh, each patient had a mark, a color mark, uh, on on the wall above a about our head, and red color or yellow color or blue color, and and I was hospitalized, and my color was the seal, the mark was red, and so I knew that my uh, physical situation was not very good. And because I, I was sick for a long time, I became friends with my doctor, and he became my friend, so he really worried about me. And every uh, once, once every 30 minutes, he came over to my bed and looked at to see me and asked me if I was okay. By his action, such action, I knew that I was going to die. I was very close to death. So uh, at that time, I thought I I had been a Christian for a long time already, and I should have I should I had already known that we would go to heaven after death, but. In that situation in which I was really faced with death, um, I didn't have confidence and I didn't have hope. I didn't have belief that I would really go to heaven. So I found out that my belief, my faith, was just on the surface. I really didn't believe from the bottom of my heart, and I repented. But, but as f as about heaven, the Lord gave me some gave me grace that uh, He caused me to experience uh, to make me imagine what heaven is like. Um, a son or brother, Ide Koroama, died, and but he was the, the eldest son of brother Ide. And a long time after he died, uh, his brothers and sisters they missed him, and they prayed to God to call them to see him. Uh, call them to know how he is doing in heaven. And a miracle happened uh, when uh, they happened to take a picture of the a family picture. Uh, uh, this uh, the, this eldest, eldest son was uh, with them 
in the picture and and there was walls of Jerusalem behind him in the picture and brother Ide showed that picture to me and I did see uh, his eldest son uh, was in the picture uh, with the walls of Jerusalem behind him so uh, the Lord uh, I could experience this kind of thing, so the Lord wanted me to believe more in heaven. Well, I could see the walls of Jerusalem in the picture, but I, could, I didn't see the inside of heaven yet. So it's like uh, you came to this Antioch church and you came to the outside of this building and you saw the outside of the building. This is how I could look at the heaven. But the Lord gave me other experiences to show me that heaven is real. And when I fellowshiped with the late Pastor Merlin Carotas, he gave a testimony about his father. Uh, he, his father, uh, at the point of his death, he said he wa wanted to go to heaven and he didn't want the doctors and nurses to make efforts to uh, let him live longer because of some uh, treatments. So, so, you know, what kind of preparation sh sh should we do to, to go into heaven? That is, um, we need to know more about heaven. We need to know more and believe more how wonderful heaven is. So, uh, we can hope for that have we can hope for heaven and so that at the point of death we will not uh, be afraid but we will have hope and look forward to going to heaven now let's watch another short movie about Hakuba camp
はいどうもありがとうございます。From July 25th to July 28th, we have Hakuba Camp. The main camp will start on the 26th. Please come and join us. In, on, on the process of getting to know God, where、well, I used to be an evangelical Christian, and that was my beginning, that was my start. And at, in those days, I thought that obeying God would be a hard thing. But I made a lifelong commitment to the Lord. But, and, and people praised me. They uh, said uh, to they said to me, You chose to lead a hard life by making a life commitment to the Lord. And I was, I felt sa- the same way. I chose to be an evangelist. I, I, I intended to lead a hard life for God, but that,、uh, but that was wrong. Because I continued to obey God. I, may, I had a lot of fun. God gave, let me rejoice more. Well, so the way of my thinking used to be wrong. I had been just religious. The Lord wants us to listen to God's voice and obey, it, and He wants us to fellowship with Him. And he bless, he, then he b l e s s Of course, he, he gives us eternal life. Everyone who believes in the Lord Jesus receives eternal life. But not only that, but also the Lord gives us a lot of things that will make us happy. And in this Hakuba camp, I find many things. That the Lord used use to make me happy. And、uh, some people say that if, I, if they had been in Hakuba camp when they were a, chi- well, a young child, their Christian, their Christian life would have been changed. And ha- why? What is the reason why the Lord wants to make us happy? Because he loves us, he loves me, he loves you. And if you think that nobody cares for you, that's your misunderstanding. You misunderstand a lot. The Lord says to us that he loves us, but he also does specific things for us to show his love to us. Well, some people might say, oh, it's only Pastor Akimoto who likes this song that celebrates Hakuba. I think many of you have experienced. And if you don't think you have experienced, you just ha- haven't realized, you just haven't recognized that you already experienced. In this Hakuba camp, you'll be very much blessed. You know, this is a very j- joyful camp. And also,、uh, we will be blessed spiritually. I'm not talking about、uh, ghosts. I have f- heard a lot of stories about Christian camps that they. S- They, see, they happen to encounter with evil spirits or ghosts in the campsites, in the camp venues, but I'm not talking about that.、Uh, I'm talking that we'll be very blessed by God spiritually. For example,、uh, ask for praise and worship. You know, this is the work which is a foundation for revival, and we're 
we will have a great time of praise and worship and praise praise song contest. This camp is filled with spiritual blessings and and practical blessings. If you don't have money, seek God and ask Him. And if you can't take this off from your work, don't quarrel with your bosses. Just pray to God and He will open a door for you. Now let's watch another short movie about the team to Cambodia.
The team to Cambodia will be sent from August 21st to the 24th. Oh. I, I always forget the dates. We might, we might as well for change the dates. I'm just kidding. Anybody is welcome to participate in it. We have holy meetings in the evenings. And in the afternoon, we we'll go to swimming pool and we we'll go bowling. We'll enjoy barbecue. Please come and join us. Well, spiritual blessings will be filled with. This team is full of spiritual blessings. Uh, the first time, my son John. Uh, went to Cambodia. Well, when he decided to do that, he was planning to uh, go to Canada for ski, uh, for snowboarding for a month. But a prophecy came forth saying that if he went to Canada, he would see an evil spirit. Then he changed his mind and he decided to go to go on a race to Cambodia instead. And then his life was totally changed through that outreach. And now our orphanage in Cambodia is in a trans in a in a turn in is in a turning point because some of the children are now grown ups and uh, some of them they have jobs. But uh the Lord tells us that they are the cornerstones in God. That means that the Lord is going to do His works through them. You know, names are, are accompanied by His qualities. That's a biblical thinking. You know, the characters of the Bible, they were given names by God, and their life manifested the quality of their names. Before I, got, before I was married, the Lord gave me a Christian name, Paul, and since then, since I named myself a Christian name, Paul, uh, the Lord expanded His work through me. Uh, like Paul, in like Apostle Paul, I studied to do missionary works in various parts of the world. And as he was criticized a lot and slandered a lot, I was also slandered and criticized a lot. If you are burdened to join this team to Cambodia, please come and join us. As I have already told you, I've been suffering from back spiral uh, canal stenosis. The Lord has healed me already, but I still have difficulty walking. And now it's getting hard for me to to travel. And I find myself 
and unwilling to go out of the country. And the Lord points, pointed out to me, uh, I was unwilling, I was retreating. And, and the Lord said that I've been stopping my work, uh, things to do. I've been hesitating to do things that I should do. And so I agreed with him. And so I decided to visit Ukraine this coming September. Please pray for this outreach to Ukraine. Uh, we will visit some local churches to minister with them. We also go to Slovakia to minister with some local churches in Slovakia. And this route was opened by missionary Sally in a church in Prague. And I knew that if I missed this opportunity to visit Ukraine, I would I would lose more things in God. And the Lord also told me to go to Amami Oshima Island to to inspect uh, children's care center. Or, uh, operated by another NPO. And I went to Amami Osma Island and this place is is the World Heritage site. And we visited a beach, beautiful beach. Uh, so this island uh, we we could build a pension, a hotel, or a, pen, a small hotel, a pension. And those people who used to operate uh, children's care center in Amami Oshima Island, uh, they're they're now trying, they're now closing their children's care center because they are planning to migrate to Laos. Laos to start an orphanage there and we had a talk with them and we uh, we will we confirmed that this is with the will of God for us to take over the uh, children's care center uh, we have heard from them that usually they uh, they used to receive uh, children uh, who were mistreated and who who f fell into delinquency, and well, we decided to take over their wor work, and we went to the prefecture hall, where actually Pastor Majikina called a person in charge in. Kagoshima Prefecture, then the person who answered the phone, uh, he knew Pastor Majikina already because he had seen him the last time Pastor Majikina had visited this children's care center in Anami Oshima Island. So they, so he already heard about our possibility of taking over that Children's Care Center. But in, at that time, we didn't have a qualification to take, actually take over the Children's Care Center because we had to change an article of association of the Cornerstone Orphanage so that we could be able to operate a Children's Care Center in Japan. But now we have been successful in changing the article of association of the of the cornerstone of it, so, and so we are going to take over this uh, work. Let's give thanks to God for that. Let's uh, please pray for this work. Well, uh, maybe we it's not really orphans that we will take care of, but we'll 
will receive children who are mistreated and who are not taken care of by their parents um, because of some, for one reason or another. And we were very glad that we could see the hand of the Lord when Pastor Majikina called the prefecture hall because he knew him. Now, this is a, a leaflet, a pamphlet of a movie called Hax, Hax, Haxel, Haxel Ridge. Uh, this movie it has been drawing good reputations uh, in general society. This movie talks about Christianity clearly, but even non-Christians, they like this. Um, for example, Mr. Hiroshi Kume commented after he watched this movie that if God is like the God who uh, who appeared in this movie, I'd like to believe in him. So uh, we you, we can use this movie to bring friends to together to watch it together for evangelism. Let's watch a preview of this movie. ハクソリッチの戦いで戦場の常識を覆す男がいた。ファンタスタスナトリーヴァンバイオレンス。ユーセイニケゴトゥプリズン。10年ぶりの監督作品。ユーアフリートゥランアンドゥデヘルファイ
For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son. So, our foundation and and our base is His word. And when we put our trust in His word, then we will experience. And and God prepares wonderful works for Him, for us. As I told you, the Lord blesses us spiritually. He forgave our sins, and He gave us eternal life, and He gives us. Uh, he gave us life, but also He wants to make me happy, make us happy. Yesterday, I saw a uh, His work. I had a holy meeting in Chiba Prefecture, and a fan of the gifts, the gospel music group gifts, a fan, their fan, came and came to the holy meeting to see the gifts. Uh, because uh, before the holy meeting, uh, they had a concert, they held a concert. And usually people who came to the concert, they left when the concert was over. But this fan stayed. And it, it, it's not that he, uh, he dared to stay in for the holy meeting after the concert. But he just missed an opportunity to uh, he missed an opportunity to leave the play, the venue, and he happened to st stay there. And and after the concert, I started a seminar on the spiritual gifts. And this person, he I could see that he thought that he was in the wrong place. And after the seminar. I thought he would leave, but he again missed a chance to leave the venue, and he happened to stay for the holy meeting after the seminar, and and you know, so I was going to speak before a non-Christian, and. I thought that I would have to change the topic of my message that I was going to deliver. And I was asking God in my heart, what should I speak? And then the Lord spoke to my heart that I should invite Him to accept Jesus in the message. But I didn't think he would accept Jesus because I I I had seen the an expression of his faith face during the seminar. He really didn't like being there, but the Lord said to, told me to say an invitation to accept Jesus, and I started a message. And toward the end of the message, I invited people to accept Jesus in prayer. And then one person, he said out loud that sinners prayer with me, and he accepted Jesus. Let's give thanks to God. So. so we, the Lord is going to give us a big grace. Uh, dear Heavenly Father, you are going to start to do something, but uh, you are not stopping, but a uh, step forward, and then a new thing will happen to you. Uh, you have a problem, and you would like to ask for somebody's help, and uh, you are wondering if that help will come to you. The Lord said that that help is important, but 
the more important help is from God. And if you pray, you'll be able to be helped by God without the help of another person. Uh, you've been thinking on human terms and you are now desperate. You are in a desperate situation. Ask God and seek God. When you seek God, God will uh, help you uh, in a way that you don't you don't expect. Now let's uh, pray for healing. Let's repent and seek healing in our hearts first. And dear Heavenly Father, thank you that you are here. I, in the name of Jesus, I bind the power of sickness. I command each our bodies. Uh, we command our s the sicknesses to leave our bodies. I declare God's healing. Y you are you are recently looking dimly, looking at things dimly, but you are he God healed your eyes. Uh, you you have problem in your throat and lung. You are healed. You uh, you have a problem in your right thigh and nodes and you another person nodes and another person head headache, but you are healed. Uh, I declare God's healing to everybody. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. of the Lord Jesus and the love of the Father and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us all forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. Akuba Camp Patmos Team to Patmos and as for is to Ukraine and Slovakia, uh, to join this team, you are required to uh, take a class of World Missions, the second in the seminary. Announcement about uh, Hakuba camp from July 25th to July 28th. Anybody is welcome to join this, uh, this camp. We have morning and evening holy meetings. And we have time of recreation. Please invite your family and friends. You can pick up the uh, application form at the reception. You can visit our website about this camp. And we have buses to go directly to the hotel from this church. Uh, please apply. From the students' assembly, from 2.15, we have a service here. After that, uh, we will we'll cook together and have lunch together. We will have tacos. And team to Patmos will be sent from July uh, 11th to 20th. 
Uh, the affair is by Air France, 210,000, 8,500 yen. And we'll fly by as for the team to uh, Ukraine and uh, Slovakia. Uh, we'll take, uh, we flew fly by Polish Airlines. The team to Cambodia will be from August 21st to 24th. Anybody is welcome to join this outreach. We'll fly either by Thai Air or ANA. On, on August 11th, we, ha we hold Hokoro Gospel Concert. And from 4.30, we have a staff meeting for this concert here. And we pass out uh, leaflets and tracts and pamphlets to advertise this concert at 3 o'clock in, in front of Coen's station. Now we dismiss.